Hello everyone, welcome to Okuni and today we are going to discuss about a very important topic What is the total installed capacity of India? Yes, everyone knows uh, that we are generating the solar power plant from solar power plant, thermal power plant, coal power plant but we don't know what is the contribution of these different types of energy resources in Indian power sector and what is the total installed capacity of the India and today we are going to discuss what is the total install capacity of India and what is the contribution of the different energy sectors. We are generating electricity from different types of power plant for example coal power plant, gas power plant, diesel power plant, nuclear power plant, hydro power plant, renewable energy resources for example uh, solar power plant, you know biogas, wind power plant. Let us start with the total install capacity. So whatever the electricity we are using now that is not coming from the some particular uh, power plant because all the power plant which is installed in India which is connected in the grid for example uh, wind power plant which is connected to the solar power plant and solar power plant is connected to the grid so in the grid itself there are so many power plants so the total install capacity of the India in April 2022 is nothing but 401010.23 megawatt you can see in the slide you'll get the idea the total installed capacity in april 2022 is nothing but 401010.23 megawatt let's convert into the gigawatt so you'll get the idea what is the total power plant capacity in gigawatt this is about 401.0123 gigawatt this is the total installed capacity of the india so what is the contribution of this thermal power plant gas power plant solar power plant and this total 401.010 gigawatt you can see the pie chart they are blue color which is nothing but the coal power plant and you'll get the idea more than 50 percent of the electricity which is generated in the india is coming from or is generating from the coal power plant so whatever the electricity we are using now that is the contribution of coal power plant is more than 50 percent so the total installed capacity of the coal power plant in india is about 204.0795 gigawatt let's convert in the megawatt you'll get the idea 204.079.5 megawatt this is the total installed capacity of the coal power plant and the contribution is 51.75% of this you know of this all these uh, generating power plant so obviously we are importing the coal from the different countries we are mostly generating the electricity from the thermal power plants and we are depending on the 51.75% uh, on the thermal power plant this is a non renewable energy resource Let's start with the different uh, uh, energy resources, for example, renewable energy resources. So in the renewable energy resources, you'll get uh, you know, uh, uh, wind power plant, biomass, solar power plants. So what is the contribution of the renewable energy resources is about 28.25% uh, of this electricity which is generating from the uh, renewable energy resources like solar power plant, wind power plant and biomass. So what is the capacity? So capacity is about 111.399 gigawatt or let's say 111.399 megawatt. So this is the uh, total installed capacity of the all renewable energy sources. For example, solar power plant, wind power plant and biomass. Next is gas power plant. Let's start the uh, you know, number of power plant which is installed that is gas power plant so the gas power plant is total power plant capacity is 24.899 gigawatt or 248.99.5 megawatt this is the total installed capacity of the gas and the contribution is about 6.31 percent okay 6.31 percent of electricity which is generating from the gas power plant if, if you are talking about the diesel power plant, so diesel power plant is 509.71 megawatt that is nothing but 0.509.71 gigawatt. Okay, well, what is the contribution? So it is very you know low power plant capacity so it is not actually visible but I'll, uh, it is the total power plant capacity is 509.71 megawatt. Okay. 
now what is the power plant capacity of the nuclear and what is the contribution of the nuclear power plant so nuclear power plant capacity is about 6780 megawatt that is nothing but 6.780 gigawatt so the contribution of these uh, power plant of nuclear power plant is 1.72 percent so whatever the electricity generating in india so the 1.72 percent is coming from the nuclear power plant as we knew as we know we are not uh, installed that much of uh, nuclear power plant in india so we are not generating that much of electricity uh, so that is just uh, 1.72 percent uh, from the 100 percent of the electrical indian power sector okay the next is a hydro power plant okay hydro power plant is a very good energy resource and now we have installed so many uh, hydro power plant in india so the total power plant capacity of the hydro power plant is 46.722 gigawatt so that is it is nothing but 11.85 uh, uh, percent so this is the total installed capacity of the india and the contribution of the india in the hydro power plant okay of the hydro power plant so these are the total installed capacity of the india if you are going to add all these uh, power plant you will get the uh, total 401.01023 gigawatt so this is the total install capacity of the india and uh, if you're talking about the, uh, the you know the different power sectors or if you're talking about the uh, private sector or you know state sector or central sector so these are the uh, you know uh, so many power plant is under the private some some power plant is installed under the state sector so what is the contribution of these uh, three uh, sectors it is nothing but central sector private sector and state sector in uh, february 2022 uh, you'll get the idea ki total power plant capacity from the central sector is about 98.3326 gigawatt okay so it is in the megawatt so let's convert in the gigawatt so you'll get the idea uh, private sector 191.954 gigawatt state sector 105.325 gigawatt so these are the different sectors we are in generating the electricity from the different sectors these are the power plant capacity in march uh, uh, obviously the you know as we know so many power plant is installing solar power plant is installing uh, you know uh, wind power plant is under the installation so uh, day wise or month wise the uh, power plant capacity increases so if you are talking about april uh, 2022 so you will get the idea that central sector is uh, about to generate electricity is 999.004 gigawatt private sector is 197.148 gigawatt state sector is 104.856 gigawatt so mostly private sector will get the uh, much more contribution than the uh, government and state sectors uh, so many power plant is under installing under the you know government sectors and private sector and the state sector so this is the all india installed capacity sector wise and the category wise so what types of power plant is installing so i hope you understood all these uh, things so this is the data uh, uh, in the april 2022 uh, obviously in the april uh, then may then june you'll get the uh, more power plant capacities uh, so i hope you understood uh, i hope you understood the total install capacity of the india category wise and the uh, sector wise thank you so much for joining with me or thank you so much for uh, watching this video thank you everyone